South Coliseum where we are five minutes into a unbelievable match a Mississippi chain match with Buddy the father and Robert the son going against Johnny Gray and Bill Dundee George Barnes the Australian co-champion with Bill Dundee who was scheduled to be in this bout tonight was not permitted to wrestle due to a high fever and an increase of blood pressure. John Gray from Australia taking his place and it has been absolutely one wild melee since it began. We're about six minutes underway. Johnny Gray in the yellow trunks. Buddy Fuller over in the corner chained to Bill Dundee. And I believe that the bell has sounded Five minutes, 49 seconds, and as we joined it, a minute and 40 seconds in, after we joined it, the Fullers, Robert and Buddy, are winners of the match, but Buddy's not content with just the win. He's trying to pour back some of the punishment that Bill Dundee had given to him in two previous matches. There goes John Gray out of the ring. Dundee, still chained to Buddy Fuller, goes out on the floor and Fuller gets the cuff off. And Robert and Buddy with their hands raised, signifying a great victory over Bill Dundee and John Gray. Here comes Dundee, he hadn't had all he wanted. And Buddy gives him a little more. Johnny Gray into the turnbuckles and out on the floor. The winners, Buddy and Robert Fuller in a Mississippi chain match. Dundee sprawled out on the floor. Johnny Gray gets back to his feet, but very unsteady. He grabs the ring post and holds on before this capacity crowd of 11,300 in the Coliseum tonight. Robert Fuller, who has been denied on several occasions recently by disqualifications and other flukes that belie his outstanding wrestling ability, being carried out of here, and Buddy Fuller helping right along with it with his younger son, Robert. And so the victory goes to the Fullers over Bill Dundee and Johnny Gray. This is Lance Russell from the Memphis Mid-South Coliseum.